Hey guys, this is John from Vapor Hunting Technologies. Today I have a chrome piece from our Ford motor restoration that we've been working on. I want to see if dry blasting can easily remove the chrome. So we're going to use aluminum oxide inside two machines. We're going to use the 220 aluminum oxide inside our 2000, and then we're going to use a 30 grit inside our 4000. So without further ado, let's get started. All right guys, and we're back. Here is a perfect example of how dry blasting with aluminum oxide can easily remove chrome coating from your motorcycle parts, car parts, just any parts that have a chrome coating. On this side right here, this is the 220 aluminum oxide. And then on this side is the 30 grit aluminum oxide. So both did an excellent job. As far as speed goes, you're definitely gonna go for the 30 grit because it is very aggressive and when i was blasting it it took i would say less than 10 seconds it was like it was taking the chrome easily off the 220 again very exceptional it took a little bit longer because it's a very uh, it's not as aggressive i think the next intensity from the 220 is probably the 120 so if you're gonna look for like removing chrome with dry blasting it will probably either be 120 or a 30 grit aluminum oxide and again it really depends if you're just interested in removing it either grit will serve you fine. It just depends on how fast and how aggressive you want it to be. If it also depends on what kind of prep you wanted to do. So the 220 gives you kind of a nice clean matte finish, very smooth, while the 30 will give you a very aggressive or a very rough surface for perfect for powder coating. If you guys have any more questions about how to remove chrome, we actually have done a video about removing chrome with using 220 aluminum oxide. You can check that video over here. But like I said, if you have guys have any more questions, you can call us at 828 we also have a website at www.vaporhuntingtechnology.com. Follow us on our social media and appreciate you guys for watching and we'll see you next time.